it's Raina, and I'm coming to you with the newest offerings of Sailor 50 States, Iowa, and Nevada. So for whatever reason, Penn Chalet did not have, and they still don't have, North Dakota and Hawaii in stock. But they did have Iowa and Nevada in stock, so I ordered them. They literally just arrived like 5-10 minutes ago. I'm about to have a sneezing fit one second. So here we are. So we're going to swatch these on uh, coloring cards. I have a Moon Man mini glass dip pen, a couple paintbrushes, and then I'm going to s fill a couple of Twisbees. Not very, f not not a lot, just a little bit to, I mean, I could probably just dip them instead of filling them, but then I got to clean them anyway. So I might as well just put a little ink in. So I'm going to start with Iowa because that's the one that I grabbed. Um, um, yeah, if I can open it up. So we have Sailor 50 States Iowa, another golden color to add to the um, lineup. A cheerful yellow ink that mimics the yellow of corn, the crop the state is most famous for. So here we have a corn yellow. It's still cold because it was sitting in the mailbox. Fresh from the mailbox. Okay, and I ordered these from Pen Chalet. Oh, this is a nice yellow. Sailor. Fifty states. Iowa. And oh, I don't like the way that I look. overkill, but I'm picky. Okay. Ooh. It's a really neat yellow. It's like, enough, it's orangey enough to be golden. I don't know, this makes me think more marigold than Technically, like corn, I guess. So that's that. Do, 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 do. And then we'll go ahead. I'm really excited for Nevada. Nevada, Nevada. I say Nevada. Um, it's like a rusty, a rusty red orange sort of color, and I think it's going to look real nice with Texas. I think it'll complement it very well, or at least that's what I'm hoping. A warm orange red ink inspired by the Red Rock Canyon and the beautiful red landscapes the state is known for. does remind me it's like a nice color like if you get off the strip how do I get cat hair everywhere Sailor 50 States Nevada This one doesn't really want to leave the, okay, that's fine. I could say that one doesn't really want to leave the pen, but it did. Okay, it's a little lighter than I thought it was. That'd be perhaps a tiny bit more saturated. But that's okay. Still lovely. The application feels really watery though, so I'm not sure. I mean, Mm -hmm. 
It's definitely very wet on the card. But yeah. Okay, I thought it'd be more like Texas a little bit and it's not really. That's okay though. This is such a pretty, it's a pretty ink. Now, I'm gonna set these off to the side because we have some coloring to do. I shouldn't have put these inks away. We have pens to fill. I'm gonna do Nevada and the green one. Tiniest of fills. Do you all keep your boxes? I do because the cabinet I keep my ink in has a window and I don't want to like ruin the integrity of the inks. So keep my ink. Plus it's easier to fit on the shelf that way. Okay, these are both medium Twisbees. I think my roomie's home, so I'm probably going to have to do the comparison uh, without speaking. Um, I'll probably just put music over it or something, but I want to get the coloring in. If Ruby's not home, somebody, the neighbor is home, but it sounds like it's right outside. So anyway, let's zoom in. So Minnesota, Iowa. I'm carefully coloring the line because I don't know if I got over the line in any of these other spots, except for this one spot in, uh, in Wisconsin I did. It looks great on this paper, but trying to color these things in on this paper is not lovely. There we go, Iowa. Then we have Nevada. I'm gonna do it with this, I think. I like having the line though. Nevada looks really nice next to California. Green color. Pretty. This is throwing me off. This color looks really nice next to the colors around it. I'm coloring in smaller strokes here because this paper doesn't really like it when I try to color large swaths. Okay. We're filling her in. We're filling her in everybody. So I thought that this would be maybe a little darker, a little closer to Texas. Um, it's not. 
nothing wrong with that. It's just I expect I expected for some reason that it would be a little darker. So that's that's perhaps on me. But it looks really nice. Like I can't wait to see what they fill Utah in with because this is a nice little section. Like a nice little color coded section. Oh, I can't wait to see what they come out with next, except now I gotta wait like two months. Because I think they've been doing these like every two months or so. Nice. I wonder if this is going to be like a sky blue sort of color. I mean, they kind of have like a sky blue here, but. And they have that. Maybe like a dusty, one of those like dusty, like color versus rainy day blues for Montana. I'm not sure. I don't know what they're going to do for Minnesota either. That might be some sort of blue or teal because of lakes, perhaps. I'm not sure. What else is Minnesota known for? I mean, I'm sure it's known for lots of things. I used to live in Wisconsin, so we learned a lot about Minnesota, but that was a long time ago, so I don't know. I don't know. I'm still thrown off by North Dakota. I feel like that's like the biggest shock color for me, I think, so far. I think for whatever reason, mint green for North Dakota is, uh, it's boggling my mind for some reason, but yeah, we're filling in. I think this is number 34, 33 and 34. So we only have what, like 16 left to go. Awesome. I'm looking forward to seeing what they come up with next. Okay. These swatch cards should be dry or dry enough that I can um, show off what the rest of the things look like. Somebody, I think it was that Mike, the person that has been doing the artwork for the 50 states, um, he was commissioned by Sailor North America to do those artworks. Um, I think he just started doing them for fun and then they were like, oh, by the way, we'd like, to, we'd like you to do all of them. Um, yeah, so let's go ahead. So we'll run through our states so far again here's texas and nevada by the way before we get them all laid out here um actually we can just do like a comparison to all the browns and oranges once we lay out all these inks that's new york virginia illinois delaware oregon florida Pennsylvania. I'm going to sneeze again. Okay. Idaho, Washington, Maryland. We'll compare the yellows and the golds too. This might look, this might be good to compare with both of them. Alaska, Vermont, Michigan, Oklahoma, Georgia, New Jersey, this might be, New Jersey might be the closest one to that, but it even looks oranger, you'll see. Louisiana, Arizona, South Dakota, Indiana, Wisconsin, Kentucky, Tennessee, running out of space, Wyoming, Maine, that forks up my light. This is a nice little rainbow we've got going on here. Mississippi. West Virginia, Hawaii, and North Dakota. Sorry, these ones at the end are a little scuffed. I think I think it's because the cards are curlier. So I'm gonna put these back in order so I can do comparisons. Okay, so Nevada, it's still a little damp. So Nevada, I wanted to compare to, here it is next to Arizona. Coordinating, I would say, I think they look nice together. Uh, New Jersey will save that one. Um, here it is next to Maryland. 
This is like a sunflower color, so it's a little yellow, a little brown. Oops. Here it is next to Florida. Another red orange, a different shade of red orange. This definitely reminds me of like terracotta or clay or something. And here again next to Texas, which I thought it would be more comparable to and it doesn't seem to be. Okay, and then Iowa. I have that yellow I really liked from Van Diemen, so I'm going to pull that out and compare that as well, just for funsies. Here it is next to Arizona. Not that they're really comparable, but in case you're wondering, here it is next to New Jersey. I would say this leans a little more orange compared to New Jersey. They are different. It's hard to tell on the camera, I think, but they are different. Here it is next to Maryland. And also Florida. I guess that's it for that one. And then um, here it is next to that Van Diemen's European Honeybee Eater that I really like. I feel like this is more closely uh, comparable to New Jersey, but they're also different. It's a little grayer maybe, mute, more muted. Um, but yeah, since this is a recent yellow uh, find that I've really enjoyed, I wanted to share it next to that. So I'm going to let these finish drying. They're a little damp still. So let them finish what they're doing. Here again is our map, our 50 states. It's filling in nicely, 16 more to go. I still hope this is kind of a dark color since I have this uh, oopsie right there, but yeah. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think. Are you excited if these represent your, excuse me, your state or a state that you are um, tied to in any way? Let me know what you think. Are you excited about these new colors? Um, just since I have them all sitting here, here are the latest four. We swatched these in a separate video that you will see before this one, but here are the four latest offerings of the Sailor 50 States inks. And there you go. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll talk to you soon. Take care. Love you. Bye.